there's no way out now. There's always another way here, Batman. All the people that Thomas Wayne condemned to this place unwillingly, they speak through the walls. Their ghosts walk. They know the way. I can't help those people now, but I can help Alfred Pennyworth. Take me to him. My pleasure. Oh, here we go. Whee! Final battle time. I can feel it. Nice boots. Vicky! <laughs> You've already lost, Vicky. Come out and surrender. <laughs> Giggling. Uh, Alfred must be tickling her. Go. Maybe not. The butler has to die. Why? Payment for Thomas Wayne's sins. He took away my family, so I'll take away his sons. If you really want to save the butler, bring me Bruce Wayne. Okay. If anyone can enough. find him, it's you. He's probably cowering behind him. 12 inch thick wall and a hundred bodyguards right now. I'll bring you Wayne, but first, let Alfred Pennyworth go. No, no, no. Afraid he's too useful to do that just yet. You're doing so much for one old man. Yeah, this time I did it. Vicky. Stop playing games. This isn't a game to me. You know, Batman, I really don't understand. Why are you fighting me? I've done great things for Gotham. That seems Falcone fucked up. and Hill deserved to die. If anything, I did you a favor. We're fighting the same fight, Batman. Are we? Can you see that? Those men deserved their day in court, just like everyone else. So they could have gotten off like they did so many times before? No, Batman. They got exactly what they deserved. My justice is final and absolute. Your justice was fucked up. You shouldn't be here. You shouldn't be defending him. You think uh, Bruce Wayne is any better than Tom? He hides so. behind his status and wealth. He's a coward, blaming other men to carry his burden. Yep, not today, Satan. <sighs> the suit does not protect. Oh, there she, there she is. I'm curious, Batman. I know why I wear the mask. It's who I am. Who I was always meant to be. What about you? What about me? Do you wear the mask to hide? Or to become who you really are? Both. Are you the man? Or the mask? Batman is who I am. Who I need to be. To do what must be done. Yes! If that's what you believe, you're lying to yourself. You wear the mask so that you can't be held accountable. Nope. And once you're dead, I'm going to mount that mask on my wall. But first, I'll see the man beneath. What are we doing? Down. Nice try, bitch. Throw a battering at her ass or something. doing under Arkham Aww. poor Alfred hold on Alfred uh, you 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 came you came for me 
Shh, Alpha, don't say too much. After what you said, I knew you'd come. The man, the man I, I made you. Just hold on, Alfred. Stop talking. Did you see where she went? She just dis disappeared. I'm getting you out of here. Above you! <laughs> Interesting how you speak to him. So familiar. Alfred? <sighs> Such concern. For someone you've never met before. It's called compassion, Vicky. Something you seem to know very little about. Sounds like mm -hmm. deflection to me. There's more here than you're telling. It makes me wonder. Do you really care? Only one way to find out. Batman, oh. don't you... Shut up, old man! You've seen my true self. Hmm. Your turn. Prove that you can. Take off your mask. Let me see the man you really... Let's do it. That's what it will take to save you. No! Yeah, bitch! Look who it is! It's me. No, Bruce. This must be some kind of trick. Bruce Wayne, he, he'd never be the man Batman is. He only looks out for himself. Oh, but of course. <laughs> now I understand. Batman, you can prey upon the weak, the defenseless, oh, just like Jesus. your father did. A true way. Oh, <laughs> shut up. There's nothing heroic about you. I can't change what happened in the past. I would have fought for you, Vicky. No one should have to suffer the way that you did. You don't know how I suffered. But you will. I'll show you what Thomas Wayne did to me. To my family. Ow! Well, there's some of my ear gone. Motherfucker. 
sucker! There goes your teeth! As to last week's events at Arkham Asylum, a spokesperson for the GCPD assured us that the breakout has been contained and all inmates have been returned to their cells. The... Miss Vale is missing and presumed dead following blurry. a gruesome battle with the caped vigilante known only as the Batman. Okay. Her death marks the end of Children of Arkham's reign of terror. <laughs> <sighs> if the public knew the half of it, it's better that they don't. Uh, this came in the mail. It's unsigned. Huh. Selena. With everything that's been going on, I... She does love me. I haven't gotten a chance to thank you for what you did. Sacrificing your identity for my safety. But... Uh, she did. It was a dangerous thing to do. You could lose everything. The secrecy you've worked so hard to maintain. Gone. Without you, none of this would work. You are my family. You don't know how good it is to hear you say that. You'll remember. After it. everything that's happened. And your ear? At least there's something left of it. <laughs> Dr. Tompkins assured me it adds character. <laughs> that it does. We will get through this, Bruce. Don't lose sight of the fact that you've done some real good for Gotham. And she's dead. You should be proud. Gotham is safer now. I only hope the peace will last. We could all use some peace. Yes. To peace. Now you gotta clean. The damage done by the children of Arkham has left Gotham a city in turmoil. Faith in those at the top has perhaps irrevocably been shaken. Acting Commissioner James Gordon has promised to speak out about the issue tonight during an emergency citywide address. And I hope, despite the recent terror that's gripped our city, that Gotham's leading citizens will come out to show their support. Will his token appointment be enough to regain the city's trust? It remains to be seen, but experts agree that... Gordon hmm. requested Gotham's leaders to stand behind him. Leaders like you. Let Gotham see who Bruce Wayne truly is, and let them know what you plan to do for his future. 
Well, this could be a fresh start. For you, and for this city. Though, Needs it. in Gotham, the only figure that can make as much impact as a Wayne is Batman. You've helped this city tremendously, both as Bruce Wayne and Batman. And that person, whether he dons a cape or not, is someone I'm proud of huh. and honored to call my friend. Be my daddy. That's a lot to live up to, you know. I won't let you down, Alfred. I know you won't. So, what do you intend to do about tonight? Well, Lucius has yet to invent a suit that'll let Bruce Wayne and Batman be in the same place at once. That is unfortunate. I gotta make a choice, don't I? I suppose you must decide whose appearance will be more valuable. As Bruce, you can help repair the damage done to your name, get the public support so that you can change things from the top down. But Batman is a symbol of justice and strength. Maybe in these dark times, that is truly what Gotham needs the most. Hmm. I Perhaps think... one is truly the mask. And one is who you truly believe you are. We'll, we'll come in as the mask. Gordon, no. Bruce like Wayne Bruce. will be there. You'll make quite the impression. Gordon will be grateful. Because I'm really Batman! <laughs> oh, let's see how this turns out. Commissioner Gordon. He is here. Commissioner Gordon. That mm, doesn't sound right. Don't worry. Sounds perfect. It will. Thank you for having me, Commissioner. What might have happened to your ear? It looks painful. Cut myself shaving? <laughs> What'd you use? A chainsaw? Well, to be honest, I was surprised to get your call. Now, after that nasty business at your manor. I know Harvey was a good friend of yours. A loss like that. I wouldn't blame you for lying low. What you did is no secret. These people all saw there's more to Bruce Wayne than just the playboy. Batman. Public opinion is bound to swing around. Well, before long, you'll be Gotham's golden boy again. Gotham doesn't have to like me, but I do hope they'll hear me out. I appreciate that. I was half hoping Batman might show up, too. I wouldn't mind knowing he was keeping an eye on things here. Well, too bad he's not here. Wouldn't mind meeting him. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> well, he's not much of a talker. I'm ready for you, Commissioner. Now, during times like these, it can feel impossible to hold on to hope. But I have hope. Hope that together we can rebuild what was lost. Yes. Now, in the last few weeks, as much violence and terror as I've seen, I've also seen the citizens of this community band together to fight those threats. And one of those people is Bruce Wayne. Yep. You know y'all shit on me. Thank you, Commissioner Gordon. Tough act to follow. <laughs> <clears throat> Okay. I'm here today to not only show my support for our acting commissioner, but also for this city. Many of you have suffered terrible losses. And mm -hmm. Some of those losses came at the hands of my own father. Or at least as a result of his actions. I would like to take this opportunity to apologize to tell you how sorry I am for the pain the Wayne family has caused this community. If my recent incident with Harvey Dent has shown me anything, it's that I can no longer sit on the sidelines. My family's wealth was built on the suffering of others. I think it's time to repay that debt. I plan to use my resources to improve the city and make the lives of oh, its yeah. citizens better. 
And to that end... A closer alliance between the GCPD and Wayne Enterprises will provide the police force with the support, with the training, and the equipment they need to oh, make happy. Gotham safer than it ever has been before. I own the police! The GCPD will be the most technologically advanced police force in the country because the people of Gotham deserve to feel safe. Who left? Oh, they're not leaving. They're trying to kill me! Who the fuck are you? Clear the area! Get that bastard to lock up! Why are you trying to kill me? Minutes ago, Bruce Wayne delivered a rousing speech that turned into a shocking assassination attempt on his life. He sure does clean up well. <laughs> see you soon, Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Zip five. City of Light. Came to an end. Alright. I was in the majority of my choice on distracting the penguin. Um I was in the majority of comfort Alfred that he wasn't to blame. I was in the majority of responding to Selena. I guess everyone wanted him to love her, wanted her to love him. And me and 73.1% took off the cow, so it wasn't that wrong a choice. Thank you. Okay, so so a lot of people 61.6 .6 addressed as Batman as Bruce. And that's that. Let's check out my season overview. Collaborative. Uh, okay, okay, okay. I did 80% Bat and Bruce. And then, yeah. 